What's up guys? Yep, we're back with uh, another video. We're just casually sitting here waiting for these zombies to turn. Because for some reason, uh, I don't know, they got infected. So, yeah. We just uh, healed them. And now we just, we just played a waiting game. Just, uh, come on guys. Turn. Turn back. Turn back. Please. Why is he taking so long? There we go. Boom. All right. Nice and better. So now we can uh, start. Hello? No. Come here. Thank you. All right, back up we go. All right, so yeah, this is basically our carrot farm, as you see. I mean, it was until they decided to turn into zombies. But how it works is basically pretty much this guy is trapped in his hoppers. Well, basically inside the hoppers. And what this guy will do... He will plant all the seeds, and then uh, obviously once they're all harvested, he'll grab the carrots, throw it to him. The guy will miss, and uh, yeah, they'll fall into the hoppers, go down, 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 into the chest. And that's, it's literally that simple. That's, that, that's how simple it is. So yeah, we've done quite a few, done quite a bit. Let's just go sleep so it's nice and uh, bright. One second. Yep, yep, yep. Hello. Hello. In here. All right. Yep. So... So we changed the door because it was pressure plates. And uh, the zombies kept on getting in. So we made it a piston door. All right. If I can get out. Awesome. Oh, crud. Okay, so this is the building, what we've got so far. It's huge, as you can see. So what we have, let me see if I can make it in. There we go. We built two, uh, what, what are they called? Sugarcane farms. We built two. So we've got two of them. They're, no, let me up. They're running quite efficiently, so yeah, it's pretty good. You see in the top one. I need to make something else on top as well, but I don't know. Let's just turn around here. Ow. Here are our traders. So we've got some good traders. So this one, amending for one emerald and a book. You literally cannot go wrong. This one, we're going to have to turn into a zombie and then fix him again, but he has loot in three. So yeah. The, uh, the rest, we haven't got them yet, because for some reason... I don't know what happened, but these guys in there, if you can see them, died. So I had to spend a good five hours trying to find a new village with two of the same breed and blah, 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 and bring them all back. It was a nightmare. But anyway, you're probably asking yourself, nerd, uh, is there a reason why you have a wall full of heads? Well, yeah, basically what I do is I trap a zombie here. Okay. And then when I want cheaper trades and all these bad boys grow up, I just let the zombie get in there. And then I'll bring one, bring him to behind one of these guys and let him do, do his thing. Turn him into a zombie. Then I heal him and then I come here and uh, just uh, I get this bad boy. And I just whack, not like whack, get the heads and make a little memorial. But yeah, that's pretty much it. So what we have done so far is done a couple things since the last time you guys were here. So let's just go down here. So we have a cow farm right here. So what we do is grab our wheat, come over here, press this button. They come swimming up. Make sure to have nothing in our hand and uh, just feed them. That's it. Feed them all. Get them nice and fat. Yeah, go all the way around. Make sure every single cow manages to do his thing. There you go. Drop this back down. And the baby cows will fall to the side. That's literally what they'll do. So the baby cows will go to the side. And we put the wheat back in there. And let's just wait. Hopefully they... Uh... What's that noise? All right, hopefully they grow up soon. So let's go check our sticky farm. Oh, there's a sticky coming down. Where? Yeah, I can hear him. Here he comes. Come on. Let's go see where he is. This one? No. This one? No. There he is. Little small boy. Oi. Oh, where's the golem gone? Okay, for some reason, so this keeps on happening. My golems keep on disappearing. And I don't know why. If anyone knows why, let me know in the comments. But yeah, this has been twice now that I've had to replace these golems. Okay, so the, it's just that one. Yeah, it's been twice now. Like four of them were gone. Do I have to name them or something? Is that what it is? But anyway, let's go check how much we got. Are we rich? Oh, Nelly. We have a lot of sticky here. Oh my god. Uh, I think it's safe to say we are rich on sticky. Let's just uh, make blocks of this. <laughs> Put that there. Let's grab all of this. 
Let's just turn this all into blocks so we have a lot more space. We're going to have to do something with this because we can't just keep on getting a load of sticky and doing nothing with it. So, yeah. Let's uh, just turn all this into blocks. Put you there. One, two, three, four, five, six. None in there. All right. So, we still got something there that we can't turn into a stack, but... Let's go uh, put this away and see how many sticky blocks we have. That is a lot. I think this is our best farm so far. She's got the ladder here. By the end of the episode, I've got to remember to uh, replace that iron golem. Not that uh, the efficiency is going because uh, we are whew, making so much. But yeah, decided to put a bunch of sticky here just to let people know. Oh yeah, this is ours. Are the cows ready to be harvested? No. All right, let's uh, go up the ladder. Ow! Come on. No, this is hard to maneuver. All right, in our little chest we go. How many sticky blocks do we have? Oh boy, we are sitting on a lot. Look at that. That's crazy. It's actually crazy. We are getting a lot of blocks. All right. So, no, not that. So I went, with, I went mining the other day, and uh, we came across this spawner right here. And this is a zombie spawner really close to our base. Look how close it is as well as a skeleton. So we decided to uh, fix it up. And uh, yeah, we basically converted it into a drowned uh, because drowns drop gold. All right. So if if they if it was just a zombie, they wouldn't have drop, be dropping gold. But if, because they're a zombie, they drop gold. And we have, that's how much we got so far. So it's quite a lot. And we still have to smell all of this. I haven't even put anything in. But yeah, this is the little design I went through. I've done it blue to make it sort of like an aquatic theme. Because, you know, they're turning into drowns. But this one is actually kind of slower. Because what they have to do, they have to go down the chute. Go all the way there. Go all the way up. All the way across. Down here. There's no full damage. However, there is water just on these two blocks here. Which makes the zombie stay underwater and turns them into a drown. So you do have to wait a bit for them to actually become it. And yeah, and then you just go to town. So it is a little bit slower, but yeah, it's uh, not too bad actually. Let's see if we can get a few to come down and I'll show you exactly how it is. But uh, yeah, I still need to put a grindstone here. I need to put a smelter. I put this little lava design. I'm not too sure if I should stick with it because of that. Now I've got no space, but I mean, I could like... You know, make a staircase here to go down and make like another little room on the side there. Because I want to get a uh, cleric. Because if we manage to get a cleric and um, we manage to actually convert him to be a zombie and then back into a cleric so he gets cheaper trades. He trades for rotten flesh. So if we can get him down to like one rotten flesh... That's all these will be emeralds. Every single one of these will be emeralds. And that would be amazing. Okay, they're starting to come down. So let's see. They literally cannot hit you no matter what. Because of that slab is right there. And then this is here as well. But uh, are you going in, mate? Go on, go inside. There we go. Let's turn our mob spawn down quickly. Just so you can... There you go. Let's turn it down a bit. All right. So once they turn... You hear that sound? That's them turning into a drowned. So we'll just wait for a few more of them to uh, go into town. This is what we got so far. Uh, let's uh, empty it. I will put it away over here quickly. Uh, we got rotten flesh. I don't know what to do with all the heads, but I'm getting a load of heads. But uh, yeah, they're turning into drowns as we speak. Nope, that's not what I was meant to do. All right, so you see there, just turn it into drowns. So let's just uh, go town on them for a bit. All of them aren't drowns, but still. It is a bit of a slow process. However, you know, it, it does drop gold. Look, what, a little baby zombie just turned there. He's floating. Oh, no, there's one there, one there. Come down. So the good thing about this... Are you coming, mate? Baby zombies can't attack you. So, as in, like... Because they're only one block high. So, usually, this that slab wouldn't be there. And they would just attack. But we put the slab there. So, that way, the baby zombie doesn't actually attack us. But... Yeah, so that's what we get. We've got a carrot for some reason. I'll take that. <laughs> Just need to eat. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So uh, that was that, what we've done. Let's see, is it dark? It is. Let's uh, get to sleep. Spin around. So oh yeah, this is our cat. We put a cat here so that way creepers don't come anywhere near us. Because uh, creepers are scared of cats. So we built one more farm. 
which is way back here. Now, this was meant to be a creeper farm. However, for some reason, it's just, it just keeps on spawning spiders as well. So, that I don't mind because I can get fermented spider eyes. However, for some reason, the water keeps on, like, spewing so much. So, what I realized what I have to do is grab a load of trap doors and uh, stick them all on the side there. And then what happens is the... Uh, hello there. <laughs> Are you okay? Can I help you? Ugh. All right. Do I have a boat on me? I do. All right, mate. You uh, just go... You go there quick. There we go. All right. So, yeah. It literally spawns absolutely everything. As you can see. A chicken as well. For some reason. But, uh, yeah. So, what I have to do... I have to put a bunch of trapdoors on there. Because the water just spills into here. So, this way we have the water stopping as well. And then, pretty much... We're going to get ourselves a load of gunpowder. All right, let's bring him back because I actually want one uh, because I want to see if I can turn it into a cleric. So uh, let's bring him over here onto the island. Come with me, sir. See, uh, what I initially wanted to do was actually bring this person into the... All right, follow me. Follow me, bro. All right, so what I actually wanted to do was actually bring one of these clerics. Are you coming up? Into the actual uh, zombie spawner. So that way it'll be a bit easier to transport the foreign flesh. Come on. Come on, follow me. Come on, bro. You coming? All right, just get in a boat. It might be easier. Uh, okay, can I transport this this guy over? Uh, all right, let's try get him into the house. Come here. Come here, bro. No, no, come here. No, where are you going? All right, you know what? I'm going to put him into this house here. All right. So I might make this my little potion room. We, I don't know. Okay, why is there only one door? Is there another door here? Uh, no. Okay. All right, let's go grab uh, our brewing stand. And uh, see if our trade of him will be rotten flesh. Because that would be absolutely amazing. So come on, up we go here. Hello, kitty. Uh, open this door. Um, It's over here. Anything there? Let's grab all of this. Oh, we need a door. Because, uh, yeah. But you know what? We're going to make an iron door. Yep. Iron door. Do I have iron pressure plates? I've got iron door. Even better, sir. All right, let's make some iron pressure plates. There we go. Okay. Okay, let's, uh, whoop. Boom. Okay. Uh, let's get rid of this door. Let's get him out of there. Let's uh, put this brewing stand up. And hopefully, and hopefully, go to it, mate. Get the job. You're a cleric. Rotten flesh. Okay, so you see 32 for one emerald. So what we need to do now is actually kill him, believe it or not. So we need him to die by a zombie and then we can uh, make him better, essentially. So we need to wait for night time. Hopefully a zombie will spawn and then, yeah, we'll just get him in here. So let's go out of here quickly. Uh, can we get a zombie to hit night time? All right, well, let, while we wait for that, I want to show you guys one more thing. So Elle and I decided to become parents and breed ourselves a turtle habitat. So as you can see, we got a good few turtles around here that are spawning eggs. Uh, let's grab some seagrass and see if they'll do it for us. Come here, guys. Come on. Come on. Off we go. They're so slow. <laughs> so uh, let's just feed them here. All right. Feed that one there. Feed that one. Come on, guys. Here's your food. Okay. That should be enough. Do I have any more turtles down here? Oh, I've always got this rogue one over here. Come on, buddy. Here we go. All right. So... Put this away. Hopefully, some of them are going to start. Yeah, this one here, as you can see, he is starting to lay his egg. So when they do that thing, it means they're about to lay an egg. Let's see if you can see it. There we go. Just lay. There we go. Just lay some eggs right there. Uh, one, two, a four stack. Oh, you are very good. This one's laying some eggs as well. Somewhere. Come on. Where are you going to lay? You decided to lay it somewhere else, did you? Come on. You're going to lay it. There we go. So we got some more. They laid some more. So what we're doing? We are coming over here. We are harvesting the eggs, okay, because we are going to open a shop that sells eggs. Oh, you're going to harvest some as well? <laughs> Go ahead. Come on. Come on, eggies. Harvest them for papa. There we go. How many do we have? We have a four stack as well. All right, let's grab these eggs. All right. Okay, so what we're going to do, we're going to just put them away because we're going to open a shop that sells like slightly unique items okay so this is what we're gonna sell as you can see we got a bunch of turtle eggs right here we're not selling this i don't know why that's there but yeah we got a bunch of turtle eggs here puffer fish 
Nautilus shells, name tags, and phantom membranes. So I did want tridents as well, but I can't seem to. I haven't done a farm yet for it. But the reason you guys might be saying, "Nerd, why are you doing uh, shells for uh, uh, eggs?" Well, base. Can I get out? Well, basically, eggs um, <clears throat> are. Let me see. I I'll show you. So eggs are very attracted. Like mobs find them so attractive. Okay. So I'm gonna grab an egg right here. All right, I'm doing this for you guys. You know, you know how much I hate going into the Never, but uh, yeah, we're doing it. So I'll show you exactly why. So if we come in here, go into the Never, try find ourselves. That's not what we want to find ourselves. There's a chicken in here for some reason. <laughs> we'll try and find ourselves a. Do I have any food? I don't. <gasps> Can I eat this? I can't. Up there, there we go. One. Nope, that's not one. There we go. One just spawned. Okay, so these pigmen over here are absolutely attracted to these eggs. So if we just uh, plant it there, look, look, he sees it. He's, I don't like the egg. I don't want it. Uh, uh. And he, look, and they end up stepping on it. So they are actually amazing for gold farm because if you manage to get a gold farm, I know you shouldn't hit these, but however, if you manage to make a gold farm, that's how you make it. You make it with these bad boys. And what happens is you make a big spawning platform, you can put an egg in the middle, and they will all just come towards it and die if you however you want to do it. But yeah, people use eggs for uh, gold farms. So that's why I decided to do it. Because they do break. So if a pig does pick oh god, we gotta go inside. But so if a pigman does manage to actually uh, you know find himself uh, and actually gets the egg and breaks it, their gold farm is kind of broken. So we do need to you know fix that and we give them the uh, options to buy some more eggs can i make it a hole i can't know i gotta fly back around whoosh nice all right let's get ourselves some carrots cool let's eat all right now all right now let's go find the end city let's uh we'll, we'll just fly in a straight line we'll fly to facing east yeah yeah i forgot the compass don't work in this I know, because you fall down, you're dead. So what, your, what, uh, what are we looking for again? You said something like... An end city. So it looks like a big purple and yellow building. And we need, it needs to, uh, then behind it should have a flying ship. Oh, now I see why we needed uh, a lot of rockets. Yeah, because just to get the elytra, you have to build. Ooh, the issue here is, do we even have enough rockets? Uh, I've got one, two, three, four stacks. How about, <laughs> how about you? I have one stack and... Very now. Yeah, I'm gonna land on here quickly. Where? Never mind. I'm gonna fly away because I looked at one and I'm gonna land on this one here. I can't jump. Oh. Are you kidding me? How? You had rockets and an elytra. I I, I don't. Oh, you're gonna be mad as well. Oh, edgy. All right. I'll, I'll, I'll message. <coughs> okay, guys, we found one. Edgy. 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 No. <laughs> As soon as we found one as well. Oh no, no. We're floating in the air. Oh, edgy. Okay, all right, we got ourselves a dragon head. Anything down here? I can hear a chest where it exactly is. Yeah, they sound absolutely horrible. Can you, they just sound like they're throwing up. Oh, ah, he hit me. Come on, in here, in here, in here, in here, oh. Oh god! Oh no, we're taking damage! Oh god, we're going up! Alright, we're good here, we're good here. <laughs> we're good here. Can you hear that? They actually sound like they're being sick. Look at that! <laughs> shulker, shulker, shulker. Guys, chill with this sounding like you're being sick. Can't get me here! Ah, okay. Ow! Ow! Let's just go forward. Let's just go forward. Let's not risk it. Alright. Whew. This is scary. I'm gonna go in a straight line this way. Whew, guys, this is very... I am so nervous. <laughs> Alright, let's see how many more we can get. Alright, we are back from the end city raid. And unfortunately, your boy Edgy... Um, um, so, we're going to show you <laughs> exactly uh, what we got. <laughs> we're going to wait for Edgy to get online. So we can uh, show him as well. Where are you? <gasps> Hello, creeper. Mate, I've, I've literally, like, I don't so think... Sad. Do, do, do you know what the only sad thing is? The fact that you died, we could have got three times as much. Ah, uh, yeah, I can only imagine. L uh, do you know why? Because I ran out of space and you had the craft. Uh, 
crafting table. Yeah, I had the, I had everything. Right? So we could have made shulker boxes and can. I had to leave so much stuff because I couldn't. I yeah, I even like threw away like torches, apples, like stuff. Oh you my! Threw everything you could. Yeah. Mm, are you coming to me or do mm, I come to you? No, you have to come to me. I've put it all in a chest. Oh god. All right. Okay, you have. To, <laughs> I'm on my way. You have to start from the top chest to the bottom chest. You got to leave the bottom chest for like a drum roll. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, you have that many chests. Wow. <laughs> Double chests. That's what I'm saying. I literally like I threw away half, the, like like half of what I've got. Yeah, I'm sad too. Don't... But literally, it's so easy. Like. You could literally do it if you're if you had your like a, I'm breaking and if you did it, spent an hour there, just flying in a straight line, finding the end cities, you could open a shop and sell like elytras and shulker boxes and like end rods as well. Yeah. I've got more shulker boxes than the shop has in this store. Uh, what the red one? Yeah, red, red, red. Hey, Papa. Uh, new skin. What is this? Yeah, why are you a butler? <laughs> oh wait, I. Oh wait, can you touch? Let me let me have your skin. Um, I'm sorry. Okay, <laughs> you ready? For the bottom one. Yeah. All right, go on. My piggy eyes. <laughs> <laughs> what? Hold on. And that's half of it. I had to throw the other half away. <laughs> <laughs> what? Come here. <laughs> <Turn on the> goods. <laughs> Dude, that's crazy. What? Oh uh, no. Ah, uh, yeah. Don't don't take any shulker boxes yet. I need to show L. That way she doesn't think okay. I'm stupid. All right, guys. That's it. We we're stacked. We're stonked. Remember. If you like the video, subscribe and uh, type rip in the comments for uh, Edgy. All right, bye. Can't hear anything because of these stupid things.